Uh, we talk about Sky Harbor. You know, yes, there were sir. a bunch of flights canceled at Sky Harbor today because yeah. of all the snow in the Paul Denver Jackson. area. And we're about to get more snow down we're here. We're going to get some snow here. It's mm. going to be pretty crazy. And just enough to make the road slick out there, especially up in the high country. So uh, keep annoying. that in mind. Yeah, you know, well, I, I think uh, some areas, four to eight inches. And that's wow. pretty significant out there. And yeah. even higher elevations get even more. So let's show you a live look outside. You can see this is the uh, Pine Top Lakeside area where, yes, they had some fresh snow yesterday. And uh, you can still see some of that snow off to the uh, side of the road there, close to five inches in some locations around eastern Arizona. They're going to get slammed once again uh, overnight tonight and throughout the day tomorrow. Any showers out there? Well, let's take you. You can see out towards Buckeye moving into parts of the West Valley, Tonopah, seeing some of that rainfall and some moisture all across our state. We'll zoom into Flagstaff. Some of the snow showers starting to taper off, but more is on the way and they're sitting, sitting in a cooler day. 35 degrees out there in Flagstaff, 37 in Sholo, temps in the lower 70s in Phoenix. Official high today, 72 degrees, and that right there is six degrees below average. We're going to see an even cooler day on tap for tomorrow. All associated with this, this center of the low is just uh, to the west of us currently, and this thing's basically just going to kind of hang around our state again tomorrow. It looks like on Saturday, even on Sunday, where we're going to continue to see some off and on rainfall in that forecast and some mountain snowfall. It looks like even into Saturday, we could see a, a slight chance of some moisture here in the valley, a better chance up around northern Arizona and eastern Arizona. And that's why a lot of models indicate a lot more moisture around eastern Arizona. That could be some uh, significant snowfall around Sholo, uh, up towards Window Rock, and even in Payson and Flagstaff. And that's why the National Weather Service issuing that winter weather advisory that's going to last until tomorrow evening. And four to eight inches above 6,000 feet, and uh, some locations above 7,500 feet up to 12 inches of snow. So there's your weather alerts, advisories from eight to about five o'clock tomorrow, eight o'clock tonight until five o'clock tomorrow. Temps tomorrow, little crazy with uh, some of the showers in the forecast. We'll see highs in the mid 60s, and that's well below average. We should be around 78, 70 on Saturday, staying cool again on Sunday for St. Patrick's Day, and then we warm up next week. Highs right where they should be starting on Tuesday of next week. All right, looking good, Paul.